It is Wednesday and check it out. The in the garage just beautiful. So anyway, not another garage video or to brag about mine and Caden's job we did. And there are some fantastic units open. They're gonna be really expensive, but they're gonna be big and beautiful. So I made a deal. You guys know Adrian, my buddy. He kind of just comes and he buys a lot of the stuff that they really honestly I don't sell in my auction. So it works out for works, it works for him, it works for me. He makes money, I make money. And the most important thing, it's gonna free up a ton of space. He's on his way over here right now. We have already kind of made a deal. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you what it is now or you won't stay tuned. So anyway, he's on his way over here. He's gonna kind of look at everything. We made it kind of, I guess we'll say a, a pre-deal. And we've agreed on a price. He was 200 bucks off what I asked him for. Here's the deal. Everything in this garage has been paid for 10 times over. The smaller things that you know just aren't really desirable as a uh just kind of onesie items that go well in auctions. He is really good with this stuff. He has a really big buyer base for this that I don't. So he's gonna come and it's for everything in the garage. Like the deal is for everything that's not work or personal related. He's gonna get all of the action figures over here. Remember over here, all these trash bags, all of these boxes, all of those that mountain. Look, check this out. Y'all see over there? Let's peek. That mountain is all action figures. So he's getting like everything on the shelves, uh, not my tables, uh, the radios, but look, this is all action figures. Uh, there's a bunch of gun cases. There's a bunch of really nice clothes. Uh, there's some trunks, uh, there's some nice furniture, uh, just look at all this stuff. This is all action figures and DVDs. He's getting all of this, y'all look at all this fabric, like that's a ton of fabric. So he's getting all of that, that stuff sells good for him. He's getting the folding ladder, he's getting all these tools, the uh, really nice levels, only cheap stuff if it's not like banged up and and broke so it's good that this is all really sellable stuff for him he gets all the fishing poles uh, all the golf clubs there's a whole big another set over there um, there's a bunch of tools in this uh, he gets these little display things uh, so anyway all of that he gets the fridge uh, the I think what was that Frigidaire he gets this he gets the freaking yahoos up there he even gets the dollies. If he wants the table, he can have the table. He gets all these tools. Look, there's sets, or little, um, what do you call them? Socket sets. Uh, bow, there's a bow in here. He gets more action figures, more DVDs. Uh, DVDs, this is really nice. And again, we don't keep it. If it's dingy or like missing parts, we don't keep it. But I saw that this thing was like selling for like 75 bucks, so I kept it. Um, this was like bought at auction and wasn't paid for, so I threw this in here. Uh, just a bunch of sellable stuff. This stuff over here is like all new product. It's all, it's all good stuff. Like there's no trash. Y'all saw in one of the videos I picked all the trash out. So like see the suitcase, those blue bottles. He's going to tell me he's going to sell them for a dollar, but those are blue glass uh, water bottles. And those are worth way more than a dollar. So he's gonna get all of this stuff over here too. This is all in the box, new in the box stuff. Um, these are really killer uh, vintage speakers. Uh, there's a guitar, more uh, fabric. These saws are in here, there's saws in here. Look, another saw. Uh, radio equipment, kind of Coke stuff, sports cards. Uh, see, this is kind of just fun of a bunch of little stuff that like, like I said, it's just kind of little onesie twosie items you know they're kind of hard to lot in an auction uh, but it's all good stuff like this you know the back fell off of it um, like this there's a beanie baby bear 
Um, but whether it's jewelry, stuff like that. Let's see if I show you. So the, this little whole setup right here is, he actually probably will have a buyer for this, but this is, I think four or 500 bucks. Uh, there's this like oil pan cover. Uh, this is actually in here. Uh, looks like it's new. Um, let's see, what else? What did I miss? There's like new bags up there. Oh, this little DVD thing. I think this thing's freaking killer, y'all. Look at that. I bet it changes colors like green and you know red and yellow and stuff. Uh, he's probably got good buyers for this stuff too. Look, this is all the nicer rugs that I found. Anything else uh, that was bad I threw out. But this stuff I kept. Uh, nice gun cases where all the latches work. Uh, there's some nice rugs. There's a new like uh, shag rug down there. It's never been opened. It's factory sealed. Okay, what do we have over here? Okay, so more uh, cloth. I don't know what that was. Uh, this like press. Uh, look, all these like metals. Uh, what else? These are really cool, y'all. I love these. Actually, I kind of want to sneak these out. But that would be dishonest because I already told them it was everything in the garage. Um, look, these are in here. But usually, you know, I wouldn't keep the Wheaties boxes. Uh, but look, these all have cars in them. So he gets all those. He does not get the elliptical. That's Gina's. But he does get the trunk. Look at all these toys, y'all. Look at all of these freaking toys he gets. There's more under here. There's a really nice cabinet under here. Look at this. More toys. The big toy. Um, so anyway, like, there's some nice books in here. These are kind of some of more of the hardbacks. Uh, I don't like keeping... Well, usually when you get the, the softback books in here, they're usually, like, just cash by the time um, that you get them back. So I just usually throw those away. DVDs for miles. Uh, look at all these old horseshoes. Uh, this would be good for like someone who makes knives and stuff. All right, y'all. Look, y'all remember this box of maps that I? There was like all the crappy units that day. I went to the live auctions, and so I bought this out of a unit uh, from a guy who won one uh, for like forty bucks. But I already made my money. I actually doubled my money on that. So uh, he'll get all the rest of the the maps. And again, toys. Uh, that's that really cool gun case. Let's see what's in here, guys. Hey. Oh, look, there's a tripod. Uh, never mind, that would have been not a good high school joke. Uh, anyway, so look, all these DVDs, there's Blu-rays in here. There's like a lot of new sealed ones. Look, these are sealed. Uh, there's a bunch of sealed ones here. So anyway, these are all good. They are in the cases. All right, guys, it is actually we are back from vacation we already made the deal but adrian has just got here he's backing his trailer up here's the garage now we have already made a deal for everything in the garage that includes all the action figures he's actually already taken hold on let me focus hi guys all right so he's already taken a whole truckload of action figures so he's already happy so i'm going to tell you at the end how much he paid he's taken everything except my shelves all the stuff on the shelves, all the rugs, the gun cases, uh, the last of the toys, the art, um, the trunk, everything. So hey, stay tuned. In this video, you'll find out how much I sold everything in here for. And basically I did this, guys, because I've made my money on everything in here. I've over doubled my money on the action figures. Now what I'm basically just wanting to do is kind of start new, start fresh, get my all new shelves that I'm gonna go buy uh, in here and we'll go from there hey y'all say hi to the girls y'all haven't seen them in a while hey babies y'all need some water y'all need to stop throwing your water out okay you gotta stop throwing your water out hi guys all right so look check it out this is all trash the shelves are empty this is stuff that he did not want so we made the deal before he started loading. I told him, hey, I've already got to run the dump. No big deal, I'll take it anyway. So he left some stuff he didn't want. Y'all, he didn't want this. He didn't want the sealed Lion King 2 symbol with the activity book in the back. So I'm keeping that, that's going inside. He didn't want the wood grain speakers. What else didn't he want? He didn't want the Cokes, he didn't want the radios, he didn't want the gun racks or the, the handmade rugs. This is all trash that's going to the trash. There's the stinky rats. Uh, what else did you not want? Nothing. He's, he's too sexy. He'll break my lens. I can't sell him, y'all. That's what he told me. I don't know if it's true. I'm just going to take his word on it. 
So, all right, this is other stuff he didn't want, but look, we cleared all this, cleared this, cleared this. Look, this is where all the toys were. He didn't want this, he didn't want the art. This is all junk. Well, let's take a look at the trailer. All right, y'all, check it out. So, he has a full freaking trailer. Now, for the big reveal of what he paid for it. All right, guys, for the grand reveal, y'all know Adrian, but y'all, check it out. We upgraded his presence on the channel, so he's gonna tell you how much that goes on your hand. We upgraded. I got him something special, y'all. Look, so, all right, so, all right, so you needed product, right? Yes. You gotta put, oh. put it in here. Yes. Oh, okay, so it's gotta stay here, though. All right, y'all, so check it out. He's in the game, too. He knows this game just as good as I do, if not better, but the uh, units suck right now, don't they? Yes, a lot, yeah, yeah. Man, come on, man. Yep. Put effort into this. I just gave you a great deal. We made a deal. I asked 1,200 bucks for everything in the garage and he chose to leave some of it behind most of it was the toys i've already over doubled my money triple my money on the toys i'm kind of over them so and then you came back at me with what thousand thousand bucks thousand bucks and where did we end thousand bucks thousand bucks y'all so thousand bucks y'all everything sold y'all i'm so excited to have this thing back he just took off the puppet hey give me that that goes in the adrian locker so we're gonna put this back for every time that adrian is on the channel uh maybe next time adrian and rabbi grimes will do a video all right guys we are gonna load up the trash this morning me and gina are gonna take all of this lovely rest of this trash stuff is broke all right dvds that are like uh mix matched or scratch broke whatever i'm gonna go ahead and toss all these boxes because we got plenty so anyway the goal today is to get all this trash out get all this clear and then tell you guys a big secret but anyway so we're gonna get all this stuff loaded we're gonna take it to the dump and then we're gonna go somewhere Somewhere I didn't think we'd be going. Something I didn't think I was going to be doing again. But we are going to go look at a, just a small, are we focused guys? A small facility. Because we just decided we really don't want to run our business out of our house anymore. We still just want it to be me and Gina. Because we just feel like that's more efficient. The job gets done right. So anyway, we're going to get this stuff loaded up. Take it to the dump. And then we're going to take you guys to see if possible small Grimes finds auction house small very small and it's a big if let's just see where this video goes all right so anyway like I was saying let's get all of this unloaded this is stuff from vacation uh, y'all I'm going to buy that instead of that I'm gonna buy all new shelves for the possible new location or for in here. If we do get this new location, we're gonna be actually staying here one more year. We're gonna actually stay in this house one more year if we get this possible new location. All right guys, I don't know if you just heard Gina, but we have a meeting to go see this place, possible place, three o'clock today. So it's definitely gonna happen in this video.
here, please, Mike. All right, guys, we are here at the dump, diddly dump, dump here in Plano, Texas. We're about to throw this out, and it is 212, which gives us just enough time to get to the possible new little possible place. Bang the door. blowing kisses on my stash it tickles my upper lip let's go see the possible new place teeny tiny small oh, it looks like it might be oh wait no that's alert oh look grand opening grand opening what? all right y'all look we got a new thrift store in plano so we have about 32 minutes to waste until we go look at the new possible small location but anyway so plaza thrift i don't know if this has been i don't know we've never been here but well, it says grand opening i don't know what that means a lot of people have re-grand openings but anyway hey we got time to waste let's go in the thrift store see what we can find that's a true statement guys the same setup oh never mind no we have not Look, the shelves are full. I know. Yo, we just found a new spot, y'all. Yo, y'all, check this out. So far, so good. Hey, this is pretty nice. Yeah, all right, y'all. This is like two minutes from our house. Should we look for some vintage Easter stuff? How much are their sacks? Three forty-three for a sack of Frisbees. Uh, all right. <laughs> oh, look, it's mini. Oh, that is so, that's kind of too cute. That is cute. Mini Mary. But she's a little dirty. That's a yeah. dirty Mary. Let's see what we got here. Little Easter sacks. Oh. Yeah, they got a lot of plus. Oh, these are kind of cute. Jelly Bean Junction. Those are kind of cute. You think? I don't know. You want to look these up? They may not be anything. Uh oh. Let's see how much their toy sacks are. Three bucks. I'm digging that. Not that sack, but I'm digging it. Yeah. Oh, look. Look what we got here. We got lots of sacks. A lot of toy sacks. Wow. Look at this, y'all. These little villages. Okay. Ah. So, did you find no. the figures? No. Type yeah. in Jelly Bean Junction figures. Oh, one of one? Did you leave me? Well, I think it's in the bathroom. Oh, is it not? Oh my gosh, there's so many toys they have here. Oh, this is not be my new favorite toy joint, y'all. Oh, that's kind of cute. The full armor of God. Oh, that's actually kind of really neat. I might buy that just for that. That's pretty sweet. Huh. Oh, those are like little goth tea things. We might get this bag. Y'all, look at all these, y'all. I need the buggy. Oh, is that a little boarding cow? Oh, 
he's three bucks. I think we'll get him. Who's that? Is it a holy pad? Oh, it lights up. Light up, capture the flag. Ooh. Did you hear Jenny? I think that's like a baby Elsa from Frozen. Ooh, who's that? Oh, who's this? I think I'm gonna get Eeyore for my collection. Oh, he's clean. He's yeah, he can go to our Disney collection. Okay. Um, I don't know. This has got all these golf things in it. Mm -hmm. See, those will sell a lot. Look, there's some vintage ones right there. Yeah. This one's got this cool, like, full armor god statue. Oh, I like that. So sure. I think the golf things will sell for probably <laughs> 20, 30, 40 bucks. Maybe. Yeah. Right. It's like where's Waldo, but where's Mickey? Dumpy, Jack Frost, Fuck Number One. Let's look for uh, Doctor. You know who? What's this? Oh, look at this here. Little Frozen activity set. All right, uh, so uh, nice. Actually, very nice. Very nice lady. Told us pink is fifty percent off. This looks kind of neat. Is this older? Let's see what you. No, twenty nineteen. It reminds me of that game, Don't Break the Ice. Do you yeah, remember that? I don't like that. It's too torn up and it looks cheap. Yeah. All right, y'all. Let's see if we can find some Winkies. Here. Oh, look. They got cassettes. Oh, look for Dr. Seuss books. Oh, look. A Frozen. A Frozen Funko Pop. Well, I don't know. It's $3.93 yellow. Uh, I don't think so because the box is pretty jacked. Yeah. So I'm going to leave that there. Oh, look, the Indiana Jones set, VHS. Oh, man, I love those. Okay, I'm going to check to see if there's any of the, uh, you know what, Little Mermaids because I've found three before. Oh, actually, I'm going to come here all the time. All right, I'm just checking around for this. For, oh, look, here's some older Disney books. Oh, the Emperor's New Groove. Looking for Dr. Seuss. Just in case that the silliness continues. Oh, that's pretty. Is that really heavy? 224. What? Is that 21 to No, it's 242. Isn't it? 222? Yeah, this thing was 70 bucks. Is there a check or something? I don't see one. Yeah, we're getting that. Yeah. For 242? Oh wait, yeah, that's yellow. So it's two dollars and forty-two cents. That's a steal. Oh, they want six bucks for the big little one. Accident. Here's a pretty ashtray. Do you think we'll get more than seven bucks? I think that's really pretty. That's probably glass. Oh, here's a frozen glove. Oh, that's is that what's her name? Elsa. That's honor, I think. You sure? Right? Yeah, it's honor. Four bucks. Oh, it's a, it's I'd Disney say we'd brand. We probably get that, yeah. More? Or? I think we should we should get more than that. I think we should get it. Okay. I put this one little girl with her. Oh, M G. Ah, oh, it's broke. Oh, that sucks, y'all. That was a oh. You know, I don't think I've ever found one of these in a thrift store. And it's broke. Oh, no. Pepsi. It was only 95 cents, too. Yeah, Tom and Jerry. Uh -huh. It was a 1975. I'm serious. I'm so bummed about that cup. <laughs> I'm so bummed. Yeah. Oh, who we got? Elvis. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Bad. Hey, man. Oh, man, look. Hey, look, man, Mark Martin signed that, man. What? 242, man. Who what that? I don't know. I figured. Never mind. Oh, hey, this is really pretty. Oh, wait. Old cake pan. 
It's kind of pretty. Yeah. I don't know. Is this fresh paint to Bel Air? Is that what this is? Or is it just for Apprentice? 2006. All right, guys, we are here at the location. I like this uh, already because it's gated. It's got security cameras, but the only concern I have right now is, is that customers will be able to come in and out, which I'm not too concerned about it because, look, there's places all over Dallas, but I just, look, this is like five minutes from our house. It's so close. Would be nice. <laughs> so, anyway, I'm my, I mean, I guess we could stay only shipping and maybe sneak a few people in or out. But, anyway, it'd be preferable that we could have a code for our customers mm -hmm. to get in out but that's only like two days a month so i can't imagine that they would have a problem with it anyway let's go in let's go check out the spots so of the are you serious yeah. get out <laughs> right. what are you doing, they probably acting He did, he did it. He did uh, work from Amazon, I guess. He shipped. Really? He shipped everything out from here. We got another energy guy. Actually, actually. This one, he did electric, but put Gorn in here. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah this would be a nice little little area for you. Oh, man, I should have brought my O-Light ball. Oh, you should have. Oh, does this have a bathroom? I didn't even think about that. Oh, it does have a bathroom. Yeah, this is perfect. It really is. Yeah, yeah, this is perfect. Yeah, it is perfect. Nice, small. It's bigger than our garage. Oh, yeah, you did got a little bathroom. Let's be perfect. Actually, you can put your. Well, no, we want a rolling photo booth. Yeah, but just a little thing right here. It's so perfect. Hey guys. Hey, so uh, y'all let us know down in the comment what you think. Look, we weren't gonna get another place, but like it'd be nice to have a small place. I think the rent on that place is like fifteen hundred bucks a month, which we used to pay like sixty five hundred a month. And so anyway, we just think we can be more efficient there. Uh, run a lot more product keep it clear from our house not be embarrassed when people come over not embarrass the kids we can keep our box truck up there we found a place that would basically you rent a box truck we're signing a year lease with them how much is it a month uh, three hundred dollars plus yeah like three hundred bucks a month y'all but that's nothing for a box truck you don't have to pay for all the maintenance look a lot of y'all tell us hey why don't you buy one look we've been down that road I think 300 bucks a month with them taking care of the maintenance and stuff on it. Uh, and check this out. They wrap it for free. So we're getting a free Grimes Front YouTube auction slash whatever <laughs> on the side of the truck. It's free. So that's just free advertising for the channel and the auction. So anyway, hey, we think this is going to be the best. We're kind of taking a big model like we've done and the small model like we've done from home. And we're kind of meeting in the middle because we think that might be the sweet spot. So anyway, guys, let us know down in the comments what you think. Should we stay in the garage or should we go ahead and get that place? Let us know and we'll see you at the next unit.